What's up, everybody? We kicking off season two. And on today's episode, we're talking about childhood memories, the good, the bad, and the ugly. See you in a bit. What's up, everybody, and welcome back to season two of You Heard What I Said podcast. And as y'all can see, we got a special guest today. (laughs) (laughs) It's our older brother, Doc. Welcome, Doc. Thank you. Thank you. It's about time that I participated, huh? I know, right? It only took you, you know, season it only, two. It only took exactly <laughs> to get to the premiere of season two to say, oh, I guess I should come on and support. <laughs> Look, we are just so happy to have you. This is exciting. This is the trio, guys. <laughs> this yes, is yes. it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. So, you know what? Before we get into it, let's, let's take a toast. Y'all know what time it is. Get y'all drinks ready. Yes, okay. Yes. All right. Cheers. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. All right. And we need some some sponsorships. Show it again. I know, Got that, right? That favorite burners. <laughs> I haven't had that in a minute. Yeah, yeah. Say, say that's that good stuff. They're created in the pharmacy. You know, right. For medicinal y'all... purposes. <laughs> Well, look, y'all can tell who the drinkers are over here. (laughs) Don't let the Verners fool you. (laughs) My bad. I take it back. I I just just wasn't prepared. (laughs) No, that's cool. That's cool. Look, we going to get straight into it because I know we all are some talkers. So let's get into today's topic with childhood memories. The good, the bad, and the ugly. Thank you, Doc, you know, for giving us that topic. Because, whoa, I didn't know. Yeah, you know, it, it's funny because you have these siblings growing up, and it's funny the things you remember, the things that you don't. But uh, I'll just say that I remember that I wasn't exactly the best big brother. <laughs> I mean, if we gonna get into it, let's get into right, right. it. Well, let's start it off. <laughs> what you uh, mean? Uh, yeah. I'm telling you, I remember you going around pinching me all the time, uh, and then I would get in trouble for yelling. <laughs> <laughs> like what? How did that happen? Yeah, it's funny. Growing up, I remember how I was disappointed when my uh, younger, my first sibling, uh, was. Keon and not um, <laughs> sister, because I was like, man, I wanted a sister at that point in time. And I uh, never but it, was, it was cool. It was cool because I mean, I was three. Dude, I never do that I, either. Yeah, I'm just okay. saying. I remember. Okay. I remember. It, it's uncanny the things that I remember from childhood, mm-hmm. and um, but I remember that. And uh, but that's okay. I adapted quickly. Um, I expected Keon to be at that point. Uh, my partner and everything so we played all sports we played <laughs> everything and of course i expected him to have the same skill level that i did so it was just crazy you know growing up and um so when he he didn't when he was still performing as a toddler <laughs> i bullied him i you bullied him the toddler to, to be the, the toddler was supposed to, he was supposed to be able to throw and catch like every other kid my age right. you know we had baseball gloves and you know he couldn't throw straight and just throw me nuts <laughs> oh my goodness it is just all coming out it just drove me nuts yeah. but but hey it paid off though because mm-hmm. you know when i went to play little league and i was eight he was five and you know dad convinced them he had to play too mm-hmm. and there he was and we were just talking about it. there he was in center field with some baggy pants <laughs> <laughs> pants didn't quite fit him but he was he was one of the best players out there you know at oh, five wow. you know so and so I, you know it, i kind of pushed him a bit but you know that was the good of it. He, he developed his skills at a very early age and was mm-hmm. able to keep up with us. 
the bad was that I had to bully him to get them there. Uh-oh, uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh-huh. But we're not going to talk about how I used to hold him down and tease him when he used to complain. Then mom used to have to decide how she was going to get me and that's when I learned that shoes could fly around corners. <laughs> that I remember. Hey, we got to have, like, have, have a PSA announcer right now. Right. Like, uh, how did that shoe get around that corner? <laughs> this, this was, you know, this was 30, 40 years ago, and the statute of limitation has expired. <laughs> so, <laughs> could not run the shoe. Yeah, I could yeah, outrun yeah, mom, but yeah, I couldn't yeah. run the shoe. That oh, shoe was flying. Yeah, they realized what wooden shoes... We realized wooden shoes can break. Can break. Yeah, because yeah. I remember it breaking can, on somebody. They can break. <laughs> they can break. So. That's crazy. That's now, crazy. Now, I don't know what you're talking about with the pinching business. All I can say is that somebody used to pinch me, and I said, "You don't pinch me because I pinch back." But no, I I don't remember initially. Oh, you used to be a the, pincher. The pinching. Right. Oh yeah. So so that's what happened. So. I was never the one who ever instigated the pinching. But I used to tell you, don't pinch me because I pinch back. <laughs> so if you remember being pinched, it's because you pinched me first. Wow. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The, the things you tend to block out because I have mm-hmm. no recollection of that at all. <laughs> mm-hmm. So you're being a bully, precious? It was just. I remember that. It was your way of connecting, but uh, I just we were well, not were, but we are eight years apart, so yeah, mm-hmm. it was definitely a difference. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that was your way of connecting, you know. You used to sit there and pinch me to get, get my attention, and you used to keep pinching me. And I used to say, <laughs> pinch me because I pinch back, and that's so if you remember me pinching you, that's because you pinched me first. Wow, that's crazy. Mm-hmm. Well, if we uh-oh, my, my ring light falling. What's going on today? They, they trying to tell me, stop doing the picture. But if we going to get off of bad real quick, let's go to good. Because one of my favorite childhood memories was us always gathering in the living room and watching the Cosby show. We would watch the Cosby show in different worlds. That was like, I think, like, come on, let's get ready to start. Because that was way it's before, almost, like, Thursday nights. It's almost yeah. 7 o'clock. Thursday <laughs> exactly. nights, yep. And it wasn't oh, like man. we had all the, when you could pause the episode and do all oh, that. Like, we had well, to be there. We ain't, you ain't had no VCR. You're this right. Was, no. This was before VCRs. So it wasn't no recording it. It's just you had to watch it live. Exactly. So was, but before rem- did we have remotes? Because I know we had like the, the buttons. You had to press the buttons to go to the channel on the TV. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we had like 10 channels, you had to press the button. I'm not I'm not as old as you. I don't know nothing about turning no knobs with flyers and stuff like that. Co- <laughs> come on, co hangers is co hangers is antennas. <laughs> People antennas. What are you talking about antennas? Yes, and pen and yeah. on the TV. Exactly. Especially when you had to adjust it to get that clear picture. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. I, I some aluminum that. foil on the tip. Stand, stand right there. Stand right there. Hold <laughs> 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 oh, the antenna. Stand right there. Wait. Oh, wait I can't God. watch. I can't see it from here. <laughs> yes, yes. Oh, yeah. I'll tell you. That was definitely one of my favorites. That was one oh, of yeah. the highlights. So. Yeah, you know, I remember I had to... I, I would sneak in, like, when they had... What was it? Um... Uh, the uh the awards the um grammys and i mm-hmm. remember you know michael jackson and his moonwalking thing i remember I had to sneak in i had to get on my knees to sneak in and hide underneath the table to <laughs> pass my bedtime to watch it <laughs> wow They're like Keon, is that you yeah but I, you know, I all quiet trying to sneak in there to listen to watch it but yeah so, oh so my goodness. like 83 84 yeah so, yeah man. yeah i'm yeah, sneaking you're right. in there you're right. <laughs> Now, now, just to talk about things, I, I was jealous of the, your relationship, the two of you, because, you know, Keon is three years younger than I and Precious is eight years younger than I. So, mm-hmm. so, you know, about the time that Precious really started getting into her personality and everything, which was a very bubbly personality, uh-huh. I was often I was off to high school. So you right. two, I was envious of you two because you two used to go shopping with mom. Used to always have new clothes, new shoes. I was like, hey, 
And they were like, well, you was at school. <laughs> I was like, what the hell is that fair? Like, you was in school. You know, and so I was I was envious of the closeness of the two of you because you two used to hang out all the time. You know, but that was cool. That's, now that I, I, that I didn't I didn't know. Um growing up, yes, we we were closer. We were like you said, we were the ones at home. Yeah. <laughs> like you growing up, it was like he's here and now he's gone. <laughs> that's like <laughs> that's kind of how it was, you know. Wait, come in the front door, go out the back door. <laughs> <laughs> right. Exactly. No, it was more like sneak in the back door, sneak back okay. out the back door. <laughs> I barely ever used the front door. Right. Yeah. Back so, mom yeah. used to sit there in the kitchen sometimes to catch me sneaking in the back door. <laughs> She's like, she don't she play, she sitting she here in the play. dark. <laughs> <laughs> She does not play. She did that to me one time. I had company over, and uh, she was like, I'm going to the store. I'll be right back. Be like, okay. And I was a teenager in high school, so she leaves out through the front door. So I think we good. And then she sneaks in through the back. (laughs) (laughs) And we were supposed to have like the lookout, but that lookout was not looking because she so creeped on in through the back door. I was like, oh my goodness. Dang, I didn't know she would do something like that. I, she, I'm she telling you, she didn't me. play. She learned it from me sneaking in the back door. <laughs> right. I used, have, I used to have it down to a science so that you didn't hear the key turn the lock. You didn't hear that <laughs> storm door. And mm, I was, I was, I took my time. Because <laughs> <laughs> that, that storm door was loud. That lock on yeah. that storm door was yeah. loud. Yeah. So I used to have to turn it really carefully. Then I used to sit right. there and turn the lock on the door slowly. Yeah. <laughs> and then it, she'd be it, sitting there in the dark. <laughs> <laughs> it was definitely uh, harder because, like I said, yeah, you you went to high school doing your thing with your friends. And then you were off to college. And I don't remember you coming home that often because I believe, like, during the summers, you did internships. So we would go see you for your football games. And then you were gone and you moved out of state. So it was like, where did he go? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, you know, um, in high school, it's true, uh, mm-hmm. playing football and then also um on the track team and then throwing that shot or, but, oh, yeah. shot, but yeah. <laughs> and then you know then I had the girlfriend and used yeah. to be over at her house all the time on the weekends mm-hmm. you know Friday mm-hmm. night Saturday night so I remember falling asleep over there a lot to the point where I had to wake up to go home you know <laughs> on, you know walking down at two o'clock in the morning sometimes because the bus wasn't coming. Oh and, wow. Uh, it was a viaduct and that viaduct used to worry me. So I used to have to figure out how to time my trip through the viaduct so that <laughs> there, I wasn't alone, if you will, yeah. uh, going mm-hmm. through that viaduct. Yeah. So yeah. yeah. So that's the bad. <laughs> right. Oh, that, that was the dangerous. Yeah. <laughs> dangerous. Yeah. But I, I, I had street smarts, so that was a good thing. I, I knew how to keep my back against the wall when I was exposed in public, mm-hmm. and I used to be always aware of my surroundings. So I I didn't make a move unless I thought it was safe to go to the next block. You know, mm-hmm. so. Yeah, that's smart. So what was your uh, your good like memory? The good part. So so the, the the funny the good memories were all the parties we used to have. So um, I forgot about those. We so you did. know, we, we we sit in we live in that two flat that three flat condo, and there was no parking. But every now and then, we seemed to have a party, and we most of the times they were held in the dining room, and it just it was just lots of food, lots of laughter. I mean, mm-hmm. mom used to make lasagna for my birthday, and I used to have the German chocolate cake. And you know, always had a couple of friends over at the same time, and and you know, we always had you know, we were because mom was young when she had me, she was 21, mm-hmm. 22, mm-hmm. 
um, mm -hmm. she had younger siblings, you know. And then as we got older, the parties kind of changed a little bit. But I remember the one taco party. I came late from football practice, and they told us that uh, our friend from across the street they had to stop them from eating all the time. Was it was it fourteen? Was it fourteen in here? I know it was a double. It was double digits. It was, it was probably, I was probably 15 or 16 and yeah I'm talking about tacos he ate I'm talking about oh how many tacos I don't remember I don't know the number because I think it was, it was I somewhere I think it was around those was more than it was in double digits I, I could have sworn 14 rings a bell but yeah <laughs> because because growing up we weren't wealthy but we could do some wonders with some ground beef yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know we had spaghetti we had we had Lasagna, we had tacos and man. Meatloaf. Yep, meatloaf. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, what was the one with the cornbread on top? What did we call it? Oh, that? I forget oh. about that. It was, uh, we had talked about that the other day. It was, uh, with the corn, with the corn too, right? With the corn in there? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. It yeah. Was, um, <laughs> green bean casserole. No, not green bean casserole. No, uh, uh, something uh, casserole. Uh, 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 oh, maybe it was cornbread it. casserole or something. Yeah, that's it. Was, it yeah. yeah, it was corn and corn. That bread. was a favorite. <laughs> but I don't remember those parties though. I guess I was younger because I don't remember those at all. Or maybe I was over with my god sister. I know with me being the only girl. I just, I just remember. I remember, I remember the, the card games with our god sister. Oh, no. I, I do. I remember the card games. The card games. I remember. So, well, so, so we didn't have a lot of parties because of the parking situation. Mm -hmm. Um, but no, when we had parties, they were, they were memorable. And even when we did go over to other people's houses for parties, they were mm -hmm. classics. I mean, mm -hmm. we talking about, these are the days when TV would go off the air. <laughs> <laughs> You'd hear the national the anthem. Music. Yeah. You'd hear the national anthem, you see the flag, and then there comes the snow. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh, maybe we should go to sleep now. <laughs> so. Those, those are some days. Those are some fun days. Just, what, you know. What What yeah. about you, Kia? What's your uh, good and bad and ugly? It's funny because one of the goods kind of similar to that is just mm -hmm. having those family reunions in the city. You know, mm -hmm. when we all would just, you know, meet me at like grandma's Was house Rainbow, and just hang Rainbow out. Rainbow Beach and Rainbow Park. Oh, that too. Yeah, that too. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. And just hang out just with this fan. Oh, yes. Oh, and the softball games that we played. The I don't know if you oh my gosh! And I used like, to yearn and and, and, then, and wait for yeah. That and was then so have the uncles fun. who would put on be on the grill all day. Yes. Yeah. All yes, day. Yes, I'm like that, oblivious that's... to all of it. Remember? That. Really? Really? Oh. <laughs> oh man, yeah. I mean, one just to, to hang out, you know, on the on the stairs on on, on in grandma's house, you know, oh, just hang out with all with family on the porch. I do yeah, remember that and, yeah. and all that, and just we you know, which is you know. Yeah, Unfortunately, it was we, a not lot anymore. Of us. Dozens, lot and of dozens, dozens, yeah, dozens and dozens and dozens and dozens, especially when the cousins came in from out of town. Yeah, on that porch, yep. yeah, yeah. You know, the cousins then, came in then, from North Carolina and yep. and St. Louis. And, uh, I think they were in St. I Louis. I remember us sliding down the stairs in the inside of the house. We were like, <laughs> "Go ahead, head first. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> Never mind, it was a turn oh. at the bottom. Right. <laughs> it was a wall. It's a turn to go down the last three steps. Yes. But yeah, that, that if, cool. yeah. Yeah, the picnics, I know, you, uh, Pressure, you say you don't remember. But those yeah, were, remember the, that. to me, those were classics too, because playing those mm -hmm. softball games, I mean, those were the best games that I've ever played, just having those games with family and That's just. That's cool. Uh, man, just picking, picking the teams and. And just going out there playing until the sun goes down and, and everything. And, of course, having the food and all that was just so and, much fun. And let's just, so the softball games, for those who don't know, style softball might be different from everywhere else because it's a 16-inch softball. And it was much softer than the softball that might be played in high school or in college for women's sports. It was, it was a softball that you could catch without a glove. So everybody could play. And yep, it was that was those were great times. And man, just, just to try to hit it as far as you can because you wanted to be the home run champion. And yeah, those were those were a lot of fun. Yeah, wow. a lot of fun. And, and, 
And then one of the bads I can think about is, uh, Doc, you, you touched upon it, is parking. At home. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know, I mean, depending upon, depending upon where people live at in the world, you know, you may have parking your driveway or, or you can park right, you know, right in front, a few feet away or whatever. And there are some days where we lived at, you know, in the in the neighborhood in the city. Oh, there was it, there was there was Hour. one to do there Hour there was plus. one time there was one time I double parked. <laughs> I double, I went upstairs, fell asleep, <laughs> and then came back out to park the car, you know, because there was no to park. Guilty. I'm surprised you didn't get a yeah. ticket either. Guilty. I, I did the same thing. Flashes on and right. people just would go yeah, around. Four way flashes on and yeah. you get tired. You be like, I gotta use the bathroom. Yeah, yeah I can't do it. <laughs> Refused gotta, to gotta, walk three blocks away, you know, three blocks or whatever. <laughs> couldn't find anything. And then you couldn't oh, you didn't, didn't want to park, park at a meter. meter. Yeah. You didn't want to yeah. yeah. park at the meter. You gotta wake up that next morning, what, seven before seven o'clock or something, to either put money in the meter or, or find somewhere else to park or something. And cause I wanna do that. Cause that ticket, yeah. Yeah, Man, ten dollars was hard to come by back then. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't even remember the ten dollar days. The wow. ten dollar ticket, yeah, Ooh, that was hard to come by. But yeah, that that, that park that is was crazy. sucked. Dude. Yeah, so it that really that was did. that was that was a bad. And also, uh, Doc, when we were talking, when waiting on Precious, as I'm thinking about it now, another bad was me trying to to to, to hang out with you all the time. And you no, know, there are times when you were just like, no, nah, dude, you know, like pushing me aside, whatever. Oh, really? but, I, but 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 well, there, a couple of times you, when you were in high school, and there was a couple of high school things that uh, you know I wasn't to, I wasn't supposed to be able to participate in, and and so, uh, but but I'm thinking about in terms of riding our bikes and being left, kind of, you know, where we had a chance to go from our place to to downtown, which was what. Eight miles, nine miles, or so, yeah. to, or something no, like that. And, it's like seven, eight miles. Seven. Yeah. Okay. And you got everybody's on like ten speeds, and I'm on a, a cheap dirt bike, and, and going. <laughs> and we have to go up and down hills, and I'm being left like, and you're like, "Come on, come on!" Yeah. And I'm just in tears trying to keep up with you guys. You know. But you know, I mean, you know, oh I'm, man, you know, I, I'm a little yeah. older now. <laughs> <laughs> now, now the one thing I do remember because we used to go up and down. And then on occasion we would go north and go downtown. I don't know if you remember just another good thing when we would go bowling at that right there at that little that place over that I <sighs> had to I forgot what it was called, but uh, right there we would go bowling at night, and that was so much fun as well. Yes, um, you know, it? To, it, it's near. Um, was I can't think of the yeah, name yeah. of it now, but yeah, you're right. We used to go bowling down there, um, just north of the river. Now, since y'all talking about bowling, I guess another, I guess, would be my ugly. <laughs> would be mom was in a bowling league and we would go. It might have been like Monday nights or whatever. And our cousin from California was in town. And so we're all getting ready to get out. We're all excited. Like we go into the bowling alley. And of oh, course, I'm God. sitting in the middle. I think, Doc, you probably were you in the front you probably were in the front and it was probably Keon and our cousin in the back me in the middle and y'all were just so excited because of course y'all I'm the youngest I'm the baby y'all are older and y'all rushing to get out I think you you and Keon Doc both of y'all was trying to like see who could get in there first and I'm not sure who it was but y'all were playing trying to like stop each other from getting out the car and then here it is I'm trying to get out and I don't know which one of y'all, but y'all slammed that door on my fingers. <laughs> Ooh. And that was, oh my goodness. I remember I screamed and because I screamed, everybody else screamed. <laughs> but I'm getting a little teary eyed right now about that. <laughs> I remember that. Right. Wow. But it must not have been too bad because the bowling continued. <laughs> yeah. Everybody still went in there and bowled. Like, like it's like like the flints, the like, fingers like the flints don't do 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 with this old heartbeat. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. All I got yeah. was like a cup of ice. It was like, all right, come on, we going bowling. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, no, I definitely remember that. <laughs> So, but no, it was cool. My my fingers are okay. <laughs> no, yeah, you know, I, I I had a few of those moments too. I had a few moments where I remember getting my fingers stuck in the car door. It's just weird how really? that even happened. I don't know what was it about car doors back then, but they used to yeah. they caught me a few times too. 
I don't think wow. they're happening anymore, right? I've never heard or any stories no. in the past 20, 30 oh, years yeah. about that. You know. I don't know. This was weird. Cause Maybe I remember the getting... springs on the doors, I guess, were different. <laughs> no. I don't know. That's a good, mm-hmm. that's a good question. I can figure out what we did diff- what we do differently. Yeah. Right. Yeah. yeah. Uh, the engineer. Yeah. <laughs> What's up, everybody? Nope. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode. Of... No, that I forget. I'm doing the intro. <laughs> uh, what's up, everybody? Nope, I don't want to say it. Uh, what's up, everybody? Today we kicking off season two. And no, damn, that was good energy, but I don't know what I was gonna say. <laughs> <laughs> we go through like every episode with me <laughs> what's up everybody and welcome back to another episode of you heard what i said podcast and i see no that wasn't it because y'all see 